I remembered my mic, so I'm sorry if the audio before is not up to par. It will be now. Uh, today we are talking about a fragrance that I have spoken of before, but I recently was able to get the fragrance. Thank you so much from Soul Avant Garde, who so kindly gifted me 100 Silent Ways by Nissane. FYI, everybody, I now have my own discount code, so please use CAT20 to get 20% off of everything except for mind games at soulavantgarde.com. But without further ado, let's get started talking about Nissan A, 100 Silent Ways. Okay, Nissan A is not only the first, but also the only Istanbul-based niche perfumeries and also is celebrated globally. But they consider fragrance as a symbol of how much value you put on yourself as well as your loved ones. They also have the idea that scent can create a memory and memories are priceless. So then every perfume that's created is then a memory to be cherished and celebrated. Nissan A has a series of perfume collections, one being uh, inspired by the words of Rumi, which is 100 Silent Ways, one that we're speaking of today. They also have the Shadow Play trilogy, inspired by traditional shadow play which is known as Kragas. They also have the Hasaba collection, which is inspired by the novella uh, The Little Prince. And then also the No Boundaries collection, which was created in the hopes of eliminating all emotional borders between people. Nissan A is rooted in culture and is truly creative in the storytelling behind each of their fragrances, which is what makes each collection so intriguing, is it's not just the stories and the tradition, it's the charm of each fragrance itself within these collections. So the first fragrance that I experienced within the Nissan A fragrance house that made me so uh, interested in smelling or experiencing other fragrances within the Nissan A fragrance house is 100 Silent Ways. 100 Silent Ways is actually considered a floral gourmand musky scent. Fume is said to be a tribute to all the most loved fragrances within the history of perfume making. So let's open the box itself. We have Nissan A, 100 Silent Ways. This particular box is the 100 milliliter, 3.4 fluid ounce. And we remove the casing and inside is like a storybook. And within it, the gorgeous fragrance. And just look at that casing. It's beautiful. It's like a satin bed that it rests on. And then check out this lid. I love the lid. I mean, this is a quality bottle here. This is gonna look absolutely beautiful among my collection of niche fragrances back here. Mm. So Avant Garde was kind enough to send me three fragrances and oddly or coincidentally, I'm not sure which, the other two fragrances that were sent coordinate perfectly with this. So it's like I smelled them all in my uh, open area that I usually do my videos with my paintings on the wall and the carpet just soaked up all three fragrances and it smells just just spellbinding. Because of that I actually ended up wearing to my 1 million views um, date night weekend a mixture of 100 silent ways with another fragrance that I have yet to review, but Tiziana Terenzi's Libra. Also a fragrance so lovely, it's just beyond words. Now let's spray this on. Mm. So 100 Silent Waves was launched in 2016. The top notes, tuberose, peach, and mandarin orange. Middle notes, gardenia, jasmine, and orris. Base notes, vanilla, sandalwood, and vetiver. 100 Silent Ways is considered a unisex fragrance, and I think it could be worn as that. I think it bodes well for this time of year where it's not quite spring, but it's not quite winter. It's, it's cool, and so those sweet, heavier notes um, you'll be able to wear comfortably, but it also has the light floral freshness to it that's perfect for the beginning notes of spring. I think when you first experience it, obviously you get those top notes first. You get that a hint of peach, a hint of uh, tuberose, and then that gardenia, the jasmine, the orris, they quickly come into play and then they dissipate into this beautiful vanilla sandalwood concoction. Like, 
Honestly, I don't smell a whole lot of the vetiver or really even the sandalwood. I just smell this beautiful vanilla, but it's not like a vanilla where you're making this bold entrance. It's more like a, not like a Montal vanilla. It's more of a Briar's ice cream vanilla where it's just this sweet natural vanilla that just melts in your mouth. It's just a smooth and pure, beautiful fragrance. The mix of those white florals with the vanilla just makes it elegant in lyric of a fragrance. It's not, I don't want to say that it's delicate. It's lyric. It's a fluid dance. It's smooth waves on a babbling brook. It's, it's a flowing silk dress. It's all things elegant and decadent and fluid. And honestly, it's the kind of fragrance where I experience it and I just want to drown my entire body in it. It is just that enjoyable where you just keep inhaling yourself throughout the day and you just want to envelop yourself in it. So the sillage and longevity of 100 Silent Ways are both moderate. I'd say the sillage is moderate to um, a little larger than moderate and um, longevity definitely around the moderate range though. Unfortunate part, or maybe not because personally, I don't like wearing what everybody else is wearing. I like being my own person and having someone experience my scent and like, oh my gosh, where did you get that from? And they can't just run to the nearest department store and get it. This is that scent. Nissan A is very difficult to find. However, as I said, you are able to purchase it at So Avant Garde. And again, with that 20% off, which actually makes a pretty big deal. So please use the code CAT20 when you purchase this fragrance to get 20% off of it. It is the 3.4 ounce that I showed you, the 10 milliliter, does retail for 380. It also comes in a smaller size of 1.7 ounce, which retails for 250. And again, the bottle looks exactly the same, it's just smaller. So I highly recommend that you check this fragrance out. It's absolutely beautiful. And if I wasn't romanced enough by the scent itself, the scent, the inspiration behind it were the words behind the 13th century Persian poet Rumi. He was a Persian poet and Sufi mystic of the 13th century, and I'm going to butcher this name, so I'm sorry, but Rumi's proper name was Jalal Adin Muhammad Balki, better known as Rumi. Centuries after his death, his words continue to be influential across multiple individuals. His life and teachings exemplify the universal values of tolerance reason and access to knowledge through love. Very reminiscent to me of like Martin Luther King Jr. I don't know if that's a fair comparison, but just uh, how Martin Luther King Jr. Um, spoke of love over hate. Reading about the uh, philosophies of Rumi, it seemed um, equatable. And Rumi's work was so profound that it transcended beyond boundaries of religion and race. His poems have been translated across multiple languages, a Hundred Silent Ways was based off of a poem by Rumi, uh, number 1303, from Rumi's Koliadi Shamsi Tabrizi. Again, I'm sorry, I can't, I don't know the proper pronunciation of that. Uh, however, to quote this beautiful poem, this was edited by Badiou's man Froz, Frozenfar in 1988. I whispered an offer softly in the year of your playful heart. I closed my mouth and spoke to you in a hundred silent ways. You know what's on my mind. You've heard my thoughts. And now what I described to you last night, I'll do today. I mean, mic drop. <laughs> Who doesn't want their perfume or their scent to speak to someone in a hundred silent ways? It just, it gives me goosebumps. I just, I love those words. But again, this was a rather lengthy review of Nissan A's A Hundred Silent Ways. My name's Katherine Cole. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up because it really helps me with YouTube's algorithm. If you enjoy videos like this, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you can be alerted when I post new videos. I appreciate you all. I love you all. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.